In this video, we will show you how to set up your Mintel email on iOS 11 or newer. In total, this should take you about three minutes. First, go to your settings app. Now scroll down to accounts and passwords and click on it. I blurred out the accounts here, but you will want to click on add account. At this screen, you need to click on other at the very bottom of this list. We want to add a mail account, so click Add Mail Account at the top of this list. Now you need to enter your name, your Mintel email address, and your Mintel password. You can also put in a description of your choice. At this screen, click POP at the top right. Underneath the incoming mail server, and next to host name, type in pop.mintel.net and your username is your Mintel email without the at mintel.net part. My email address, as an example, is customer at mintel.net, but I will only enter in the first part, which is customer. Now move on to the outgoing mail server below. This host name needs to be smtp .mintel.net and you do not need to enter in a username and password for the outgoing mail. It will take some time trying to verify your account until the cannot verify server identity message pops up. Just click continue and we will verify it manually. Now click on the newly added Mintel email account. At the very bottom of this menu, click on the Advanced tab. You shouldn't need to change anything, but go ahead and verify your settings match mine. The most important is that Use SSL is activated. You can tell this by the green button next to it, and the server port needs to be 995. You can change it by clicking on the banner above S slash MIME. After you've verified your settings, click the back button in the upper left corner. Now we need to verify our SMTP settings manually. So click on the SMTP banner underneath outgoing mail server. At this screen, we will click on our primary server, smtp.mintel.net. Unlike the pop mail server, this server needs to have SSL turned off. You can see that it is activated by the green button, so just press that to turn it off. The port for this server needs to be 587. It automatically populated it in my case, but you may have to change your port to 587. Click done in the upper right hand corner, then click the back button in the upper left corner to get back to your Mintel account. Now you can click done, located in the upper right once more. You have successfully linked your Mintel email with your iPhone. If you're still having trouble, you can call our tech support at 765-296-9900. If you want to access other tutorial videos, please visit www.mintel.net. Thanks for watching.